what's up guys? Um, day two of Rampage. I'm very excited. I'm feeling way better. Yesterday was a tough day. Yesterday was a, a hard day to go through because it's the first day. I didn't calculate properly how much work it would take me to do this. And I, I just started working, working, working very hard. And at the beginning and the, the first hours, I just spent all my energy and that wasn't good because I was dead after four hours and I had like, I don't know, seven more hours to go. So I had to leave earlier, but I did all the shoots that I had to do for, for Rampage. So normally I should be fine for my client. Video wise for the wall of death, it didn't really go as planned because people weren't as, as aggressive. So the wall of death wasn't as big as I wanted it to be. So in some way it's a failure, but it's still pretty cool that we did that. You know, it's, it's still an attempt and it's still a collaboration with one of the biggest DJs in the world. So I don't know, it's still a victory and I have to keep my head high, you know? I, I have to, to keep my head, you know, optimistic, you know? It's, it's still an attempt. We tried it, we got in contact and we built something cool. So right now it's the second day and we're gonna go hard. We're gonna go, we're gonna work. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling excited. Last night I, I started to feel like, oh, maybe, maybe I can't do this anymore. Maybe, maybe this is my last show because I was so tired and I felt like, oh, well, you can't see me that well anymore, but I felt like I, I've seen everything that I wanted to see with, with, uh, with, with festivals. I, I felt like I've done it all that I wanted to do. And that's not a good feeling to have because it's kind of like losing the magic, the magic of, of seeing this and being amazed by it. I'm still amazed by it, but but the magic isn't there anymore. I'm, I'm getting comfortable with it and that's not a good feeling to have. But I need to push through it and I started to feel like, ah, maybe I, ca I, I can't do this anymore, you know? But I think I was just tired. I think that's just it because this is a great job, a great, amazing opportunity. And I can't just be like, ah, I'm going to quit. I can't quit. I, I need to go through it and find better ways to do it. So what I'm going to try to do is instead of going full ham in the beginning. I'm just gonna try to spread my energy throughout the whole concert so I don't burn out so quick. And then I'll, I hope I will survive. I'll still get very tired, but I think uh, I'll, I'll feel better. The visuals are, are really cool. Everything is really cool. The people are super amazing. Interacting with DJs is still very, very fun to me because I'm starting to get used to them and they start to know me, some of them, and uh, like I start to become friends with them. And, you know, I'm just, I'm just Felix, you know, I'm just a human. I'm, I'm like, I'm no one. And, and still I, I, I become friends with them and they're the famous ones. So I don't know. It's, it's pretty cool. It's a, it's a cool experience. But yeah, I was very tired yesterday and I, I left like at 4.30, so a bit earlier, but I, what I did was uh, I went out and I tried to grab an Uber and I couldn't grab an Uber. And you know, getting out of a, of a festival is always hard, but I had my whole equipment and I wanted to take an Uber, I couldn't. So I grabbed the taxi and the taxi uh, was costing me 25 instead of 35. And that was already expensive. And he was taking, like, he was taking a weird route, not towards the hotel that I wanted. And I was like, are you sure you're taking me to the right hotel? And I was, he was like, yeah, yeah, uh, the central station. And I'm like, no, that, that's not it. And I show him where I want to go. And he's like, no, no, we're not going there. That's way too far. That's, that doesn't cost 25. And I'm like, what are you talking about? I told you where I'm going to go. So he got very aggressive. And, and I was like, okay, well, then let me out of this car. I don't want to be in this car. If I, I can't pay it anyways. And he, started, and he kept on going and he didn't let me out of the car. He kept on going and, 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 and I was like, get me the fuck out of this car. And he wouldn't let me go out. So all of a sudden he stops aggressively and, and I, I grab my, my steady cam, I grab my bag and I get out of the car. He gets out of the car and he, he, he gets closer to me. He wants to hey, pay me and I'm like, I'm not gonna pay you. Why would I pay you? And he starts to get aggressive towards me. Like he wants to fight. I'm like, I don't want to fight because I have my whole equipment and you should avoid fights. Anyways, I just, I just got out of the car and I kept on walking, but 
he kept on following me and he tried to hit me with his leg and he hit my back, but it didn't hurt and it, like, it was a bad hit. But I was, it was very close to being a fight, you know? And he, then he went to his car and I just kept on walking so I could escape in a way and, and I don't know, hide so he wouldn't like run me over with his car or something, I don't know. But I was very paranoid because he was a taxi and there was a taxi in front and a taxi inside. And I felt like maybe they're connected and they're gonna join forces and start to beat me up in the street. So I was a bit worried, I got very stressed and when the adrenaline came down, I, I, I was shaking and everything, but I survived. I took a taxi and then I went to the hotel and everything was okay, but that's why it was a rough night. As much as this is an incredible experience and, and mind-blowing experience, it is still sometimes stressful, hard, and sometimes you doubt if you, if you really want to do it, but, but I want to do it. I just need to improve in the way I separate my energy and, and how I do it. So today is day two. I'm feeling good. I feel like I rested well, which is a good thing. I ate well, which is a good thing. And I'm just excited to, to have fun. But this time, just let's spread it out. Let's spread out the energy a bit better and, and go chiller and interact more with DJs. I just want to become more friends so I can, so they can know me better and I can get more clients and get more opportunities. So very excited. We are, it's uh, eight. And so right now they're opening the doors and the people are gonna start coming. So the show is gonna start. So very excited, very excited and very excited. Let's get to this and I don't know when will be the next shot, to be honest, but I'll start recording later when I have more information of what's going on. But I'm excited for today. Day two, let's get this. Do it together! We go fire! Okay guys, there's another little thing that I want to share with you guys that was very special, at least for me. It was very special. I was filming, uh, I think it was Masterhand, I'm not sure, but I was filming in the crowd, filming the people, filming the energy, just headbanging it and pushing people around, you know, how a festival is. <laughs> This guy is crazy! And suddenly one guy that was next to me was like, hey, aren't you the guy that does the vlogs? And I'm like, yeah, I am. We just checked and, and that's it. Like, that was all. But it's the first time in seven years of YouTube that someone recognized me. And okay, it's a setup that it's prone for people to recognize me because I've done vlogs with Rampage, so people that come here usually tend to see those videos, so it's very probable that they've seen me, but doesn't change the fact that it's the first time that someone recognized me for my YouTube. This is, this is cool, this is, this is great. We're like, we're growing, you know? We're, 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 we're growing as a YouTuber. Even if the numbers might not be growing, we're gonna get there, you know? We're gonna get there slowly but surely, and this is just one step closer to getting there. So, very exciting, man. Very exciting, guys. Okay, let's get back to work. Let's go! So, it's uh, one in the morning. One in, yeah, one in one morning. And uh, everything is going really well. I'm very happy. Everything is going super well. I've been fighting people in mosh pits, having super cool shots of amazing DJs. I don't know, I, I've made some really fun stuff with Madcore. So I don't know, everything is going super well. I'm very happy and I'm like, yay, this is how it should feel. So, and, and I have energy. Like I'm losing my voice and um, I'm definitely gonna crash sooner or later, but everything is going well. I have all the shots that I need. Uh, people are happy, I'm interacting, I'm meeting with new people. Uh, uh, people are starting to know me, like the DJs and stuff like that. So, very good. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just excited. This is a good experience. I still have many hours to go. 
because uh, it's still seven in the morning this but I don't know it's it's very exciting more DJs are, are arriving behind me it's it's a uh, crazy energy people are like the people like the audience are way more excited today than they were yesterday like maybe they're crazier I don't know but they're fighting more which is good for <laughs> dubstep and drum and bass music so I don't know I'm having a great time everything is going well I'm gonna get back to work because I, I need to work this is why <laughs> why they pay me to be here but um yes I don't know excited you can hear it in my voice well my cracking voice of a teenager all right <laughs> let's get back to work bye bye <laughs> Okay guys, this is starting to be the end of the night and I want to share a special moment that I got with my good friend Matt Cord that is here. <laughs> three years ago was it? Uh, free party. Free party. Free party yeah. after COVID. There was a free party. That was the first time I managed to get into the dubstep scene and the concert scene. Yeah. And that's where I met you. I didn't know you at all, but I could connect straight away with your energy. Immediately. 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 And just so you know a bit of context, in that in that concert, he played in a fucking car. Like it was a stage. A Red Bull uh, Hummer, yeah. Uh -huh, like it wasn't the, the size of a car. Anyway, you know? Yeah, yeah. And today, this tiny stage, I could barely move. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like you, you would, you could shake the stage, you know, like how uh, just by jumping. But it was great. But every time I go to Rampage, I've seen you there. I've connected again with you. And today, I just want to congratulate and, and connect with this moment because. You fucking did this. Like, you played in, it in the sport. It was fucking amazing. Planet. It was such an I feel so accomplished right now. You know, it's like um, 15 years anniversary, our three year anniversary together. Because the free party, when he got into the scene, that was literally my first Rampage show as well. Yeah. And that's when Murdoch was like, mm, let's book him again. <laughs> yeah. And here we are, three years later, 15 years anniversary. And I'm sure in another 15 years, we'll be old and gray. But still, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I love buddy. you, Felix. I love you, my I friend. You, I want to congratulate you. And the, like, honestly, Thank this means so a lot to have it. shared that moment with and you. And I want to congratulate you for making all this amazing content throughout these three years. Like, it's been a, it's, that's a short time if you think about it, but we have both accomplished so much yes. in this time. Yeah, I fucking <laughs> love it. I fucking love you, brother. <laughs> love you, brother. Congrats. Oh. And onwards and upwards. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> I love, love it, man. I, fucking I love, love you, buddy. Good. So good. So good. I'm very tired, guys. Time to go to sleep. <laughs> What's up guys? Good morning, good night. At this point, I don't really know anymore if it's the morning or the night. It's, it's six in the morning. It's officially six in the morning and I just made it to the hotel. And it was an uh, incredible night. <laughs> it, was, it was really, really good. Yesterday I was feeling very bad when I came back. Uh, and uh, I was feeling like I, I, maybe I couldn't do it anymore. Like I was kind of still do it because it's my job, but, but uh, I don't know. I, I felt like I couldn't. And today the energy was completely different. I felt so good. I felt so connected to the crowd, to the to the visuals, to the DJs, uh, to the people. I felt like so. I felt so social. It was a really good good night. It was a really good night. It was me very meaningful. This moment with Madcore filming Nightmare. Nightmare visuals were not, the, the mosh pits were very intense. It was a great experience, guys. I'm very grateful to Rampage, like always. Thank you for working with me, it's always a pleasure. Um, if I ever complain or, or 
shared the struggles of working of of filming concerts. I I don't want to sound like a uh, like a I don't appreciate it the opportunity to do it because it is mind blowing to do this. It is and and I'm very thankful. Uh, I think I've said this a hundred times, but it, I still always go back to myself, my younger self going to con or not even going to concerts, but dreaming of going to concerts and not being able to go or dreaming or, or seeing uh, hundreds and hundreds of videos of Rory Kramer and, and the Chainsmokers touring the world and, and, and thinking how amazing it would be to get there one day. And, and now to be living this, okay, I, I'm not touring with the DJs, but I am, I am working with Rampage. It, it's pretty cool. Um, I'm exhausted, <laughs> of course. I'm gonna take a shower because I'm, I'm sweaty, I'm disgusting. I'm, 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 you know. So, thank you for watching. I hope you have a good day, or a good morning. A good day where you have an, an infinite book that you can read forever and ever and ever. It never ends. It always keeps on evolving and, and, uh, and the story keeps on growing. And it, it's a good book, so, so you don't complain. <laughs> All right? Hope you have a good time, guys, and see you tomorrow with the next vlog. I've, I've been doing the vlog, I think, six days in a row. This is still a victory. Good victory. I want to go to sleep. Good night, guys.